cookies are amazing and they are nostalgic for me. I can't watch Soren and not cry. Okay guys, so it is almost 8 o'clock this morning. I'm just getting ready. Um, I got my pullover on. We're getting excited. We're going to Epcot today. It's getting excited. I got up so early this morning. I need my ears. That's what I need. I gotta show you guys the full look. Okay, ready? Feel like Emma? This is the part that changes the whole outfit for Disney World. Mm -hmm. Whoa. I'm literally so excited. Okay, so the park probably doesn't open for like another hour, but we're gonna get an Uber and then hopefully we can get some breakfast at Epcot. Okay, we officially made it. We are in the parking lot for Epcot. I'm so excited. The sun is really bright though, so sorry if I'm like squinting. Oh my gosh. We're in line now. It's our first time at Festival of the Holidays. It's just like unbelievable that we're here. I feel like every time we come to Disney World, it's almost like we never left. Now it's just a big crowd and we're just waiting for rope drop. I cried. I cried. Can't watch Soren and not cry. These cookies, I'm telling you, I have a vivid memory of me in the Grand Floridian Hotel and my mom gave me these cookies. It was leftover from a kid's meal we had in the parks previously. These cookies are amazing and they are nostalgic for me. Looks like Joy's out right now. Okay, so we're headed to the Mexico Pavilion. And I don't know, Emma's doing some sort of like photo it's, thing. It's, Explain. it's the Disney Vacation Club uh, selfie scavenger hunt. Okay. And basically, in every park, there's five places that you take a selfie in front of, and then you show your photos to one of the kiosks. There's like a specific one for each park. Um, and then once you show them all your photos, they'll give you like a little button with like a character from that park. Oh. Okay, so we're in the Mexico Pavilion right now. Obviously you have to wear face coverings when you're indoors in Disney World right now. Um, but we're gonna get on the Three Caballeros, like the Grand Fiesta ride. So excited, it's only a five minute wait. This is what I love about this ride, is it's indoors, so it's like air conditioned. The line is always super short because everyone's always busy doing something else. But this is still a good ride at the same time. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna like go around World Showcase and go to like every single spot pretty much. And then we're obviously gonna try to do like that photo thing. Okay, we're about to get into our lightning lane pass for Frozen Ever After. Very fun ride. Definitely got wet. My jackets, I got a little bit wet from the ride. Okay, so the pizza window is in fact open. We're gonna go to the window and get a nice slice of pizza. Okay, so La Mifana is here in Italy. Okay, so we are currently on the monorail right now. Uh, we haven't left the station yet, but we're going to the monorail. So then we go to Transportation Ticket Center and head to Magic Kingdom. 
my feet are dead because I walked back and forth. We walked the whole world show. We pretty much walked everywhere and anywhere in Epcot in probably a span of five hours. We're That's gonna fine. get um, Lightning Lane for Pirates at 3.30. I went to go find a Ratatouille adventure pen like for the new ride. And I went to Creation Shops because that's where I thought they had it. And they go, no, it's in France. So I walk over to France. Like, it's like a long walk, too. Well, it's not really a long walk, obviously. But, like, in the park, it's a long walk. And so I get there. And they're like, no, we're sold out. Go to Creation Shop. We did get our photo buttons that we were talking about earlier today. And they also gave us a Luca one. Yeah, so that's really exciting. I just, they don't even check to see if you remember. They like didn't. if you just go up and tell them like, hey, I did this. And just show like one on picture. At least one picture. That's all they're gonna ask for. It's a long day, but it's a Disney day, so it's worth it. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see me because it's really sunny, but we're here at the entrance for Magic Kingdom. I'm so excited, oh my goodness. Okay, so we're outside by the train station and I hear the Magic Kingdom cavalcade music, which means we have to go and we have to watch the cavalcade. I haven't seen this castle since 2019 and it's way bigger than I remember. Okay, so we're in Adventureland. We got some water because it's like 80 degrees outside. And then we got some Magic Kingdom maps. We're doing a map collection. Okay, so we're sitting on this bench waiting seven minutes so we can get on Pirates of the Caribbean because our lightning lane doesn't start until 3.30. And it's like 3.23-ish. Okay, now we are in line for Mickey's Philhar Magic. This is actually exciting because they added a new Coco scene to it. Okay, so it's a little later in the day. We just stopped by the confectionery and Antonella got some cotton candy. She insisted. I feel like with the 50th March, like all of it, like all the good stuff is sold out. It's just a lot of like not good stuff. Lightning Lane for Splash Mountain and now we're just like waiting for the time slot to work so We are in line for Haunted Mansion. Okay, who would have thought that the standby line for Haunted Mansion when everyone's watching Enchantment? So empty.
Okay, that's better. Um, so, we just finished um, the seas with Little Mermaid, or under the sea with the Little Mermaid. My feet are so dead. Yeah, their feet hurt. Mine were hurting, but now they're like better again. Um, so now we have a lightning lane for Big Thunder Mountain. So what we've decided to do now is, because Splash Mountain's only 20 minutes, we may get on that ride again. We're gonna get on Splash Mountain again, maybe, if it's still 20 minutes when we get there, because we're in Fantasyland right now. And then after that, hopefully it'll be the time for Big Thunder. So we just put in an order for Casey's Corner. Gonna have some corn dog nuggets. I think we also ordered some chili cheese fries. Okay you guys, so this pretty much wraps up the day at Magic Kingdom and Epcot. I'm gonna finish the vlog here. Let's that pretty much wraps up this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and uh, yeah, I guess we'll see you tomorrow at Disney Springs. Bye guys!